Today we learn whether fired Waterville principal Don Ryder will face criminal charges. Ryder was dismissed by the school board after a student claimed that he had asked for sex. DA Megan Maloney is expected to announce today if criminal charges are coming. Ryder is also being investigated for similar allegations made by former students in New Hampshire. The Maine Secretary of State's office has validated the citizens' petition for ranked choice voting. The proposal would let voters rank candidates in order of preference. The initiative now goes to the state legislature, which could enact it or forward it for a statewide vote next November. Students at Bowdoin College are taking precautions after the second reported assault near campus in eight days. They've created a Facebook group called Bowdoin Safe Walk to connect volunteers with anybody who doesn't want to walk alone on campus. Police don't know if the latest incident is related to last week's. A Parsons Field man charged with abusing his 18-month-old nephew. York County Sheriff's deputies arrested this man, Baron Foster Tracy, on aggravated assault charges. The boy spent three days recovering at Maine Medical Center. Tracy is currently being held on $25,000 cash bail. He's set to be arraigned tomorrow. Thanks for tuning in to this News 8 update. I'm Erin O'Valley. I'm Megan Torgerson. Make sure to check back at WMDW.com and our mobile app for the top stories and weather anytime. Have a great day.